Well, hello there again. Um, I'm going to do a tune here called Sarah Armstrong's Old Reel. And uh, we've been playing it out here in Cal in, well, where I am anyway, in Northern California, for a long time. And we never really knew where it came from or the actual name of it. So I looked it up on the internet. And um, this fellow named Todd Clewell, C L E W E L L, Todd, has a great website of his own but a great uh, little snippet on her biography and a bunch of her tunes so if you get a, a hankering to look that's a really smart thing to do if you like to learn a bunch of neat fiddle tunes. Sarah Armstrong was born in Pennsylvania and probably in the mid 30s I'm not sure exactly when but it said that she started playing the fiddle when she was five years old and she learned most of her tunes from her uncle Laney and this is one that she that she played key of D almost pentatonic but you do use your second finger on the A string your C sharp a couple of times in here so it's not particularly 100% pentatonic but mostly anyway it's called the old reel it goes something like this It's a, actually a pretty fun one to play because it's not fingering isn't hard at all. So I'm gonna see if I'm gonna make this so you can see my fingers here. It's basically first and second finger. So that's your call. That's your first call. So that starts on the G string with your first finger A. Open D, second finger, open D, first finger again, and then your little run up and down. And then you do the exact same thing on the D and the A string. First finger, second finger, first, and then the run up and down on the A. That would be your answer. Then you do another call. an ending lick. Now when Todd plays it on his website um, he has a little, he has every once in a while he'll put in a little different ending lick. So ending licks are kind of up to the individual player how they like to do it. Mostly what he does in this particular tune and probably what Sarah does is go like this. Simple little ending lick like that. So we'll put that together First call. Run up and down. Answer. Run up and down. First call again. straightforward piece of, uh, you know, A part and B part, or A part is first section and A part is second section. Then the B part. You go up to the high D with your third finger on the A string. Okay, so let's do that again. That's your call. Answer. We 
do that same call again. And a slightly different answer, slightly different. So we'll do that call again. This is the B call. <laughs> Then you have, you're on your first finger on your D string, then you have to flip your first finger over onto the A string real quick to do the answer. Back up to the D, start again. Answer. That's the tune. Pretty simple. It goes kind of quickly, so we're going to just kind of take it nice and easy. One and two and. fun with that it's really a lot of fun to play and not that hard um, but you got to get it up to speed there everybody on the on YouTube who's playing is playing at lickety split so okay there you go we'll see you next time